Hi, welcome to Sunil Maths Tutorial. In this video, we learn recurrence relation for moments of binomial distribution. A recurrence relation for moments of binomial distribution. Observe that. We know that by the definition of rth moment, mu r is equals to expectation of x minus expectation of x whole power r. Mu r is equals to expectation of x minus expectation of x whole power r. So you can write like this. Expectation of x minus, what is expectation of x? Np mean. Expectation of x means mean. Np whole power r. Now apply the definition of expectation. Summation x is equals to 0 to n. x minus np power r. ncx p power x. q power n minus x. Remember this symbol ncx is represented by using this one ncx so again simplify what is q that q is nothing but 1 minus p that q is nothing but 1 minus p so you get summation x is equals to 0 to n ncx x minus n p power r p power x 1 minus p power n minus x now differentiating this expression with respect to p we get differentiating this expression with respect to p we get we get d by dp of mu r. d by dp of mu r is equals to summation x is equals to 0 to n ncx minus nr x minus np power r minus 1 p power x q power n minus x into uv rule x minus np power r into x into p power n x minus 1 q power n minus x n minus x into p power x q power n minus x minus 1 that's it because of you observe that we are differentiating with respect to p so here we have a p here we have a p here also we have p so derivative of u v w derivative of u v w by applying that formula here you get this term this closed bracket term and simplify and simplify by shifting this minus nr to the outside of the summation we get this step minus nr summation x is equals to 0 to n ncx x minus p power r minus 1 p power x q power n minus x plus summation x is equals to 0 to n ncx x minus np power r p power x q power n minus x and here you observe that here you observe that by making from this term from this term You get x by p and n minus x by q. x by p, n minus x power q. Because here we have p power x minus 1. But we write p power x. So you must divide with p. Here we have q power n minus x minus 1. But we write, here we have q power n minus x minus 1. But we write q power n minus x. So you must divide with q. And simplify again which is equals to summation minus nr, summation x is equals to 0 to n, x minus np power r minus 1, p of x, by applying the binomial distribution definition. Summation x is equals to 0 to n, x minus np power r, p of x, x minus np divided by pq. Again, by simplifying, there is no change in the first term. There is no change in the first term. But in the second term, this pq can be written in the outside to the summation. Summation x is equals to 0 to n, x minus np power r plus 1. Because here x minus np power r, again x minus np we have, x minus np power r plus 1 into p of x. Again, this summation term, summation term, summation x is equals to 0 to n, x minus p power r minus 1 into p of x is nothing but mu r minus 1, mu r minus 1 here. Summation x is equals to 0 to n x minus n p power r plus 1 into p of x. That is nothing but mu r plus 1. Mu r plus 1. So finally we get this expression. D by dp of mu r is equals to minus n r mu r minus 1 plus 1 by p q mu r plus 1. 1 by p q mu r plus 1. Now let us rearrange the terms. Let us rearrange the terms. By rearranging this term, we get mu r plus 1 is equals to pq into 
n r into mu r minus 1 plus d by dp of mu r in particular put r is equals to 0 in particular put r is equals to 0 if you put r is equals to 0 in this expression you get mu 1 mu 1 is equals to pq plus 0 into 0 finally we get mu 1 is equals to 0 if you substitute r is equals to 0 here you get mu 1 which is equivalent to 0 now put r is equals to 1 now put r is equals to 1 you get mu 2 mu 2 is equals to pq into n into mu naught plus d by dp of mu 1 d by dp of mu 1 mu 1 is already a constant so it is derivative of constant is 0 and mu naught is 1 mu naught is 1 so n into 1 you get mu 2 n p q so mu 2 is equals to n p q so that's it put r is equals to 2 we get put r is equals to 2 we get mu 3 is equals to p q into 2 n mu 1 plus d by dp of mu 2 simplify p q 2 n into 0 plus because mu 1 is 0 because mu 1 is 0 we write 0 here we write 0 here so d by dp of mu 2 what is mu 2 n p q d by dp of the first term is completely zero n p q into d by dp of p into 1 minus p because q can be written as that q can be written as 1 minus p. after derivating we get this one after differentiating and simplifying we get n p q into 1 minus 2 p just you simplify so mu 3 is equals to n p q into q minus p npq into q minus that's it and then put r is equals to 3 put r is equals to 3 if you put r is equals to 3 then mu 4 is equals to pq into 3n into mu 2 plus d by dp of mu 3 right 3n into mu 2 what is mu 2 npq so 3npq 3n into npq db d by dp of d by dp of mu 3 npq into 1 minus 2p differentiate here 1 minus p means that is q 1 minus p means q after simplify differentiate and simplify we get this answer simplify simplify i cannot explain the simplification just you go through with it by differentiating and simplifying please use your rules and simplify so finally we get this expression mu 4 is equals to npq plus 3 npq plus 1 minus 6 pq which are the recurrence the recurrence relations recurrence relations for the moments of binomial distribution recurrence relations for moments of binomial distribution remember that one of the important question keep learning wish you all the best